Hello dear viewers, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have got a special treat for those who are looking to enhance their English communication and wants to speak more polite in English. So let's dive into our video. First step is start your conversation with some polite words. Whether you are writing any email or you are in a, any conversation, start your conversation with the some polite words like hello, hi, or good morning. These words will make you uh, makes your conversation more polite and uh, be, uh, enhance your personality in front of the person that you are talking with. Tip number two: use magic words. Yes, the magic words that we all know. Please and thank you. Always use these words when someone helps you and use please when you are making a guest to someone or you want someone to do your some work and always pay gratitude with thank you when someone helps you and yes don't say thank you like thank you no just be more polite guys so thank you and please are the magic words use them to sound more polite tip number three addressing people respectfully yes uh, you should address people very respectfully in order to speak more uh, polite english you can use titles and uh, their last names to call them like mr smith and dr johnson uh, only use these words when acceptable like uh, when it's important to use them nor with your friends okay i know you understand like uh, even if you want to uh, talk to your friend who is very close to you then no need to use these words like hey mr friend miss friend no it won't look like a nearly speaker because they don't use these words for the people they know so try to understand this okay tip number four speak by controlling your tone or volume yes this is very important because many people use uh, magic words but don't focus on their tone or volume they just say sorry like sorry or thank you in a very large term that won't make them speak like a polite English speaker if you are doing the same then just stop doing this because it doesn't work it will make you like angry young man and yes stop doing this because no one likes this and being polite isn't about using magic words or using polite English words but it also about like uh, how you how you are pronouncing these words or how are you are using these words like you are using them in a very calm voice in a very good way but on the other hand if you're using these words like thank you or sorry don't do this please stop tip number five don't interrupt while someone is speaking yes so uh, politeness is not just about using polite words or speaking in a polite way but also about uh, listening like a active listener uh, when someone is speaking let them complete their sentence or after that you have to speak because uh, when you interrupt someone they don't make uh, they don't show interest in you because you don't uh, because they think that you are not interested in their topics uh, so just let them finish and after them they are finished then just start talking and uh, speak thoughtfully and don't behave like you are not interested in the topic so uh, it's also a very important point so that you can use to be more polite tip number six use modals yes while making requests use modals like could you would you or can you because these modals are also used for making requests in a polite way don't use the blunt commands like pass me that salt or give me your phone you can use instead of these blunt words you can use like 
could you please pass me the salt or uh, could you please give me your phone you can use these so uh, this will also help your conversation to be more polite number seven offer help and support you can offer help and support to someone uh, because helping uh, others will show more politeness and consideration you can say like is there anything that I can do to assist because everyone likes the person who helps them so try to be a polite person not like a angry young man I want to help you why will I help you don't please don't stop doing this tip number eight apologize when necessary like uh, politeness also includes acknowledging your mistakes like even if you are wrong then don't be like I didn't anything I didn't do anything why would I apologize to you no don't uh, don't uh, afraid to admit your mistake and if you did anything wrong then just politely say sorry for that like not you don't have to be like yes I'm a Google I know everything I'm never I can never be the wrong person you are wrong I won't say uh, sorry to you don't remember be polite say sorry that's it tip number nine use polite words while writing too because uh, when you are writing any email use the polite words in the beginning and uh, use please thank you in your emails so that your email also looks like a very good and people uh, to whom you are uh, sending your email they like to read your all the emails that you send for instance uh, like uh, dear dear um, uh, dear mouse dear mouse uh, please give me the report thank you like this you can use polite words in reading too so tip number 10 finally the last and tenth number tip it's all about maintaining the body portion yes uh, when speaking something in a polite way uh, remember to maintain your body portion in a very good way like keep smiling when you are making requests or saying thank you to someone and uh, use a uh, use a smile while saying polite words and uh, maintain your posture like uh, sit straight or stand straight while talking to someone it will also work a, a very in a very good way to uh, make your conversation uh, very polite and it will also affect the uh, person that you are speaking with uh, they will feel like more comfortable with you when you uh, when your body posture is good and you make a smile and don't smile like no smile like this okay so i hope you understand this tip so this is the last tip so there you have it our language learners these tips 10 tips these tips will help you to being more polite in your conversation and uh, it will help you to uh, sound like more polite person and if you like these tips then just give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel share this video to your friends that they also can learn these tips with you and uh, subscribe for more thanks for staying us till now and see you in the next video